Hello fellow stackers, thank you for joining me. In this episode, I'm going to be unboxing and reviewing the 2023 110 ounce gold kookaburra. So let's get to the unboxing. Well, thank you for joining me. I'm your host, the Silver Prospect, the Silver Stacker. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. Don't forget to hit the bell icon as I do put out new content every Friday. So now let's get to the unboxing. Purchased from SD Bullion, although I am not sponsored by them. Although, if SD Bullion would like to sponsor me, I wouldn't mind. Here it is. The 2023 Kookaburra. This is the one tenth ounce gold. Absolutely amazing. This is probably Kookaburras are my favorite. Uh, I believe that they put out one of the most beautiful coins out there. And this is a special coin. This is very special, and it's special because of one thing. Now, I know in Australia uh, for 2023, on most of their bills, uh, they are, they're not showing the king. They're not having the queen on there either. They are trying to little by little get away from the monarch, and they're exploring uh, other options. Uh, do you know on the coins, though, they are, I believe on the coins, they do have uh, the queen and the king on there. So it's going to be interesting to see what comes out next year for the Kookaburra. Um, if they're going to go with the King Charles or they're going to go a different direction. So, but, but, I mean, look at that. That is beautiful. Let's see if I can get up there. Let's see if I can turn the light off here. I think we're getting a glare from the light. All right, so got the light turned off here. See if that helps out. No, we get a so. Guess we'll turn the light back on here because we're getting a shadow. But that is beautiful. Kookaburras, definitely my top three coins that I love stacking. I love these coins. I love the silver coins. Kookaburras. Now, some of these have a P on there because they are the Perth Mints. This might be a little small to see. I don't see it on here, but for most of them, they do have a P. And this should be somewhere like right over here where they have the P on there. Now, I don't see it, but it are, they are on there. Now, I paid... $224.78 at the time the one ounce gold was worth $1,873. So I definitely did pay a high premium for these. But then again, any fractional gold, you're going to pay a higher premium. And that's just how it is. Um, so you buy smaller, you're going to pay a higher premium. If you want to buy larger you're gonna buy pay a, a lower premium but you know like i always say you gotta get what you could afford if it makes sense for you for me it, it does make sense for me to go ahead and continue investing in in a one tenth ounce uh gold coins and so here it is this is very beautiful this has two kookaburras on there it came in the capsule, which is really nice. Once again, last year for Queen Elizabeth II, they did not go with the king, King Charles. This is kind of weird, but they did not go with King Charles. Uh, I'm not sure why, but uh, there are other coins now that are showing uh, King Charles on their, on their coins. So, 
another uh, kookaburra. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, please do so. Don't forget to hit the bell icon so you're notified of all new content. I do put out new content every Friday. So I'm going to keep this video short and simple. Thank you for uh, joining me. Thank you for supporting my channel. And once again, like always, thank you and have a blessed day.